All right, good afternoon, everyone. I tried to make a vlog already once, but the audio quality kind of sucks. Anyways, I want to start making vlogs in between my abandoned building, abandoned building videos and whatever else videos I do because I have such a gap in between the videos I do. Because in fact, I'm on fixed income, I can only go to abandoned places towards the first part of the month. I mean, I could like stretch them out and go once a week, so it's like four a month at least. Instead, <laughs> but I'm so eager to go do it that I usually go every other day towards the first part of the month. So that's why you'll see um, uploads like consistently, like every other day. And then all of a sudden they'll stop, except what I can do in between. That's like either for my RV, full time RV that I want to get into, or if I decide to go, if we decide to go for a trail walk or stuff like that, I'll upload. You know, or mess with the dog, whatever. You know, just. Ah, it's not crazy crap. But yeah, I want to start vlogging. And you know, although I'm not a very good vlogger, I like to do it just to interact with my viewers and then have like discussions or whatever. You know, you can post whatever you want below in the comment section. Um, no negativity, of course. You know, no disrespect. I'll dis I'll delete any disrespect because this is YouTube. If you don't like what you're watching, you can always leave the page or the channel. Um, I haven't had that problem, of course. I've only had one negative comment that was on the Google Plus itself, not YouTube. But uh, anyways, I like to interact with you guys. You guys can comment below. Maybe give me some ideas of places to check out. I, I'm in upstate New York, so it's kind of. I mean, between upstate New York and PA, I'll go for now because I don't drive. I can drive. I don't have a vehicle. My mom drives, she goes with me, and I don't want to put that much water tire in her vehicle. She likes going though, she does. But um, I feel bad making her go so far out, or have her go so far out, even though she wants to, because it's just, it's just me. So uh, when I do get my own vehicle, I'll probably travel farther out, because even if I tr travel five, six hours out, I can, I can, you know, camp out right in my car and then drive back the next day if I have to. So if I go two or three states over, it takes me almost a day to get there, 12 hours to get there. I don't have, I don't, I don't, I don't mind that. I don't have a problem with that myself, but I can't, she can't do that. And I don't want to have her do that. So, in the meantime, we're sticking with upstate New York, Pennsylvania, you know, maybe other spots, as long as they're within, within reason. I think the farthest will probably travel, maybe four to five hours, because that would be 10 hours of our day. And then we still have to look at the place, you know, do a walk through the place, and, get it but in any case I want to start vlogging in between but I'm not really sure what to vlog about but I'm gonna leave a description I'm gonna leave a link in the description below for my Herms Adventure Facebook page that I hope you guys will click on and enjoy you know like it so you can follow along there and normally I'll put pictures there that I've taken because I always take I normally take pictures on my adventures I usually take pictures and video and the pictures go to Facebook or Twitter or Instagram and all that um, but the Facebook page will be the primary one, especially with as far as videos, because a lot of the other videos, like Instagram, I think only does 30 seconds. I think there's another app you can get, but I'm not much for Instagram or Twitter. I don't really use them. Anything I do on Facebook goes to Twitter. So I don't really interact with those too much. I haven't really gotten into it. I may down the road more, but to me, I found Facebook to be the only one I actually use. So if you guys want to click on the link below, and like that page I'd appreciate it and follow along I'll put pictures there videos go on YouTube pictures go on Facebook and then I also put normally I put a video clip because I'll do it on my regular Facebook page until I just got this page I put up a few days ago but uh I normally up, upload a, a clip you know because I do clips and then add them together at the end so if I have a clip I'll either add a whole clip so people can get a rough idea of what I videotaped or I'll cut part of it and just upload it. I'll probably do I'll probably start doing like just minute clips so people can at least get a rough idea to pique interest because if I give them the whole clip and they're not interested or you know the next part might be interesting. So I'm gonna find like the best spot to clip out and so people can watch it, at least get some interest in it. So they'll at least take the opportunity to go look at the YouTube uh, video. But yeah. I'm slowly starting to get better at this. I'm sorry about the shaky camera, but shaking. I mean, I was using my 
HCC M8 and I have it on this <laughs> coil thing that like, moves around I have clipped to my uh, chair and uh but so it shakes a lot the chair moves but anyways uh it was kind of bouncy so I switched to my HCC 10 I normally record my HCC M8 that's what I use for a cam a, a camera right now to actually go record out in abandoned places and walks and all that but I did order a camera it should be here this week Friday I think Thursday Friday our next adventure abandoned place adventure will be um, either Saturday or the Monday of next week um, the first either the first or the third one or the other it'll be because it's like I said fixed income paid once a month and uh We'll go then, so stay tuned for that video. That's why you haven't seen any from the last one until now. Cause limited income, you know, li limited funds to actually go travel. I mean, you're driving an hour out, two hours out um, every few days. It gets costly in gas, so that's why you don't see very many videos as far as abandoned bu buildings. And when you do, you see them like consistent, like every other day, because that's what we were doing every other day. That's what we used to do. Um, the trail walks for like bigger lakes but they're all local I mean they're like literally within my town the next town over so they're not that far drive I think the max is maybe a half hour drive so it's a little easier to do a longer stretch but we're there isn't much in my neck of the woods I did see an abandoned I believe it's an abandoned uh, building up back in me I, I've seen it since I moved in I kind of noticed it back there um, I see other the weeds growing up around it and I I spotted the boards on the windows. I can't, I'm not sure that it's actually abandoned. I'm pretty sure it is. Um, because I think I've walked past it before. I haven't gone around to go back. But I will, go, I'm thinking about going over there and checking that one out. Since it's only right on the corner for me. Because I can actually see it from my backyard. Like three yards over. Because my backyard joins with two other yards. So you can see it straight across. And then right past those three yards, it smacks. There's a, there's a house smack right in the middle of the yards. Well, at the end of the yard, there's a house that says right there. So that there's the yard. There's the yard is back farther. So it kind of like flipped. Whatever. Anyways, I might go check that one out. Yeah, I'm really sorry about bouncing. I'm trying to sit still a little bit, but I'm in a desk chair, so I can have the back wall. But uh, in any case, I want to start vlogging, so I'm gonna see what I can do to get something out there. Nah, uh, I don't really do much interesting stuff. You know, I have a dog and I go walking and stuff like that. But the polling and stuff drives me crazy, so I can't really videotape very well while I'm out. And, uh, which, if I have her with me, and there isn't really much to see around here, I may take the stroll up the main drag. I actually want to do some uh, public vlogging. I've never done that. I'm not much of for talking in the first place, but uh, I thought maybe I start try to do some uh, public vlogging. I try to watch YouTube videos to see you know, how all the people do it. And, I don't, I don't know if I have the courage to do it, I want to, but subconsciously in my mind, I have issues with that with everything anyways, I always worry about that, you know, people talk about me, you know, whatever, or staring at me, even if I just go out in public, period, you know, if I'm just outside and the neighbors are out, something like that, that's one of my, my, my issues, so. It'll be very difficult for me to go out in public and do it, but I want to do it. So if you guys stick around, I will end up doing it. Maybe you guys can leave some pointers below in the script in the comment section. Let me know a good way to start doing that, or you know how you started out. Um, I mean, I know I saw some like I heard that you know a good way to start is start walking down the street or whatever in a spot that there's really nobody there, and it, enter into a spot that has more people you know I don't live in a big city or anything I live in a little small town and there's not many people to begin with I can walk down my street and you might see the neighbors out a couple of them because they sit outside or whatever and walk up around the corner and there'll be nobody except cars going by and you might pass a person if you're lucky but other than that you don't really see many people out so that, I guess that would be a good spot to start and just vlog around my neighborhood temporarily and I tried to vlog out back the other day I can hear the neighbors across the street, but I mean, there's a lot of me. It's pretty much a, you know, it's kind of, I felt awkward doing it, even though they probably couldn't even hear me, because I was in my backyard. But, uh, because I wasn't talking that loud in the first place, so I don't think it turned out that great in the video. 
and I have um, a business right next to me and their compressors for their air compressors or air conditioning central air units kick on or freezer units kick on and they're loud so that kind of muffles a lot of it out and it's hard to go outside and do it because 99% of the time a train happens to go by while I'm out there and it's loud enough inside level and outside but yeah I want to start vlogging I want to start interacting with my I got that to deal with for vlogging inside you hear the dog barking you probably hear that a lot in my videos if I'm vlogging or doing any videos inside my home You'll always hear the dog try to bark, or she'll bark, one or the other. But uh, I, I want to start vlogging. All my vlogs, they're just rambling on, or just shooting the breeze, or giving my ideas, letting you know what's going on, all that stuff. I, I want people to be able to actually comment below and interact, you know, about anything. Maybe get some pointers, make some place to go, like I said, whatever, you know. So, positive, you know, criticism is acceptable. Um, I don't take criticism well in, in general, but I'm getting better at it. So, uh, low self-esteem, so be gentle on me. <laughs> so, but anyways, I figured I'd just make this video and try it out for the first time, see how well it does, and I might continue. But until next time. Take care and thanks for watching.